and you guys already know what it is. It's your boy back at it again with another video. Um, we got Rasta, um, who we're gonna be reacting to today, and the song is Kawasaki. Kawasaki. Um, it was produced in 2014. Obviously, it's on Basivity with Digital's page, and we're gonna check it out. Um, if you guys have not already, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, and definitely, um, I don't know, like, join our Discord or something, because our Discord is lit. We have a lot going on, man. A lot of people making friends, a lot of people plotting, a lot of people doing a whole bunch of stuff, so join our Discord. We'll go from there. Um, also, I, I bought a cat. <laughs> yeah, I got, I got a cat. I guess I'm gonna be able to meet her later and stuff, probably in future vlogs or something like that where I just chill and relax or whatever. But yeah, man, that'd be tight, you know, it'd be tight, it'd be cool, it'd be cool. But anyway, that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and get to this video, man, see how lit this shit really is, bro. Kawasaki. Still look like he put on some weight. <laughs> I think he looks skinnier now, to be honest. He got a little pouch going on, bro. But I guess it was him back in the day. He looks different. He definitely looks different. <laughs> oh, they got the old school, uh, old school rap type thing going on, man. I fuck with it. He, I think, is one of the only people with legitimate dreads. I feel like he has actual dreads, like not extensions or anything, like he actually has dreads, like, because I think a lot of the rappers now from other countries, and he just, like a lot of white rappers have fake dreads, bro, fake dreads, so like, literally sew them in, and I'm like, what are you doing, yo, they, these look real, though, these definitely look real. Ooh, oh my god, yo, and <laughs> welding class is in session or something? <laughs> I was not aware that this was definitely going to be in the welding class, but... Ooh. Oh, I remember this era, bruh. Ah, <sighs> major, major, major cringe. <laughs> Well, it's not, like, the song sounds really good and everything, but I remember girls back in the day that would wear their hats like that. And I'm like, what are you doing, yo? <laughs> what are you doing? But, I don't know. It's cool so far. Fuck with it. It's dope. Oh, this one over here kind of looked like, I thought, I thought that was Riri for a second. Like, is that Rihanna? But everybody here is definitely rocking a New York Giants hat, bro. I don't know why. Because, you know, this, the Chicago White Sox are pretty lit. Unless they shot this in New York City or something. Oh, my God, yo. This is, look at them trying to work on this car. Look at, look at, look at old girl in the back. She, I don't think she thinks she knows what she's doing. Like she likes you know one turn and she's already out of out of uh, breath and stuff and she's all tired and whatnot. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Look at the hips on this one. Jesus Christ! Oh my god! Clickbait. We have clickbait out the ass over here. Hold on. Boom. Look at that. I'm about to go ahead and clickbait right here. Oh, and this one too? We gotta take multiple guys. It's, it's all about that multiple clickbait. Mm -hmm. hey. I already know Rasta was up in here clapping cheeks and stuff out in, the, like, in the middle of the set or something, man. Like, I mean, you can't tell me Rasta was surrounded by all these women and did nothing. Did absolutely nothing. I don't believe it. I don't believe it.
Yo, this is dope. It has a nice little trap, like it's like a trap reggaeton type thing, man. Trapaton, man. Trapaton, bruh. That's what that's how, that's what I call it. It's like a mix between some trap and reggaeton, bruh. But it sounds more reggaeton than anything. But I like it. Dancers doing their thing. Like, look, look, what? Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, we might have to take a quick break to go handle some business. <laughs> oh. Yeah. You know, this definitely reminds me of back in the day in high school and stuff, man. Everybody was on this type of shit, bro. Like, they had the little hats to the side and everything. I don't think what the necklace she's wearing is a choker. It looks too loose to be a choker, so it's like a smaller necklace, I guess. But I'm telling you, back then, <laughs> it was different times, different territory back then. You feel me? Like, that That was definitely its, its own thing. But I definitely remember a lot of, like, you know, I call it the Kesha swag. Like, the, the singer Kesha she would wear a hat like that, and she was, you know, all about like getting to parties and getting saved, fucked up. Oh my god! <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh, like the, the beat is OP, bro. It is OP. People aren't going to be ready for this because it just sounds way too good, bro. It sounds way too good, bro. This is dope. Dancer right here, yo. I tried to break dance, man. I almost broke my neck. I remember I tried to like, ooh, I can break dance, and I kicked up into a little handstand. My hand slipped. I landed on my face, and the rest of my body went the other way. I, I could have sworn I got a little concussion or something. I was little, but as I got older, man, I'm not about to do flips and stuff. Like, I can't. I cannot. <laughs> this oh my god hey <laughs> that's lit that's lit oh, oh, oh. everybody's having a good time man buddy over here with the skull mask especially shout out to that man whatever whatever uh his name is yo like he looks the most lit right now Dude has a whole ski mask on with like a skull and bones and shit, and he's going crazy right now, man. He's going crazy. That's wild. Yo, this is oh, this is wild, man. I like it. I like it. I like it. I know a lot of people don't really fuck with, you know, um, you know, some music and stuff like this, but this sounds like a clubbing type thing, bro. Like you go inside, you hear this, you get, you gotta dance to it. This is definitely like some dancing music, man. Like some clubbing music. And like I know that the all the whole premise behind it is to get you on the dance floor and go crazy, meet some new people, have a good time. You feel me, like. It's just like a, a nice social type thing. And this is exactly what the song does, bro. Like, it's it's clutch. I like it. I like it. Hey. Everybody's swagged out, though. I do, I do see that, man. Oh. 
<laughs> that was it, bro. That was Rasta Kawasaki, bro. Kawasaki. If you guys have not already, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel because we have new content every day. <laughs> yeah, man, we got new content every day, man. We on this grind, this G grind, you feel me? And that's pretty much it. Um, I liked it a lot. Rasta has some really dope songs, bro. I'm going to check a lot more of his music out. If you guys have suggestions for me, hit me up in the comment section. Hey, all my old heads that are watching this, send me some old school rap on here, man. Send me some old school rap, man. I'm trying to react to some old school stuff because I want, you know, a mixed fan base, man. I just want everybody, every age group. So send me some old school rap. I'll check it out, man. I want to see, like, what the oldies had back in the day, what the major oldies were. And we're going to go from there because you guys already know what it is. And it's that time, guys. I'm about to bounce on off of here. But until the next time I see your beautiful faces again, take care. Peace.